Hi there, I'm Bob Chambliss, and this is a quick video on how to convert audio files over to a WAV format so that you can embed them into a PDF. This is the second of a series. Uh, the first video explains how to embed audio into PDF. If you're ever going to be embedding this and uh, doing the add button or add sound feature in Adobe Acrobat, the audio files do need to be in WAV format. So what I'm using is something called uh, Adobe Media Encoder. Uh, it's part of the Creative Cloud and it's something that all of us Full Sail students have available to us on our laptops. Um, if you're looking at the screen right now, it's, it's very busy, there's lots of things going on, but it's, it's extremely simple to use. Um, it's a very high functionality device, but, but we don't really need to use all those functions in the software. So what I'm going to do is go over here to the top left, see this little plus sign. You hit that plus sign, and this is going to add something to my queue. This is adding something that I want to convert. Um, so I already have on my desktop a M4A that's called Tacky. And uh, this is a, a, a song that I recorded um, using my, actually my, my iPhone here. Um, and I simply use the, the voice recorder tool holding up to my, my stereo speaker to record the song off YouTube. It's not very professional, but it's effective for this demonstration. But any uh, file format that you have for a sound, uh, whether it be a music, whether it be whatever format you have, you can go ahead and do this. So you just click on Tacky, and I hit Open, and this is going to add it to the queue. Now you see it over here on the left, and I have a, uh, the format is a Tacky.m4a, and it's going to be converting this into an MP3, and it's ready to go. That's what this little status feature over there says. Uh, however, in order to embed it into a PDF, I need it to be a WAV file. So all you do is you just click this little down arrow next to Format. And you have all your various options. And what I'm looking for is Waveform Audio down here at the bottom. You click that. It's going to convert it into a WAV format, 48 kilohertz. If you really want, you can look at the preset, but you only have one option. Some of the other formats have different options for uh, uh, what quality you want for the sound file. That's important in case your output is too big and you end up making, uh, I believe I made a 12 gig PDF before because it had sounds embedded everywhere in it. Um, I did not need CD quality sound, but I did it anyway. So this is ready to go. Um, it's gonna go ahead and put it out on my desktop. It's gonna call it tacky.wave and you just hit the play button. I hit start and it's done. And that's it. That's how easy it is to use Media Encoder. 